New tonight, a group of students at BYU is turning heads with the way they're showing support for the Muslim community here in Utah. New specialist Ashley Moser joins us now live from Salt Lake to show us what they're doing and what people of that faith are saying about it. Ashley? Well, Dini, yesterday there was a press conference with Salt Lake County Mayor Ben McAdams. He actually proclaimed today as Freedom of Religious Day to encourage residents to support their friends and people of the community of different faiths. Well, there is a group down in Utah County of about 10 young women who are taking that a step further. Jetting from class to class in the winter. It's very cold. <laughs> yeah. Isn't always easy. Doing it bundled up. Yeah, it helps a lot, definitely. A little better. But on Wednesday, student Sandra Sasser isn't concerned about that. Today, she has an extra layer to her wardrobe. So this is a hijab, and a lot of Muslim women wear this. Um, it's optional in the Muslim religion, but it's kind of to show solidarity. A show of support for Utah's Muslim community. A month ago, Sasser and a couple of classmates who are not of the Muslim faith started this weekly tradition. A lot of Muslims are feeling uncomfortable about things and they are feeling scared about things or um, just misunderstood. And so any shine of solidarity, I think, can be touching. No doubt it's raising a lot of eyebrows. I think people get excited to see diversity on campus a little bit. But to those who are of the faith, it's like they are saying, this is what we can support you, and, and you're not alone. Hanif Suleiman says he appreciates the steps the group is taking to try and understand his beliefs by wearing a symbolic garment the entire day, putting worldly fashions aside. If you wear hijab, you don't really have to worry about that. And you just be simple be you. I think that's the message of it. It may be a small gesture, but one Sasser believes can make a big difference in the fight to end discrimination. We have a lot in common with our Muslim brothers and sisters. I have a lot of respect for the people and a lot of respect for the faith. The best way to understand it is to talk to Muslims, and I know that people who will will be very impressed with it. Now, some of the students are majoring in Middle Eastern studies. They say they are very familiar with the culture and religion, but they're glad they're going through this experience. And they actually have been in touch with a lot of the uh, Salt Lake City community leaders, the Muslim community leaders, and they're actually getting some praise from what they're doing down at BYU.